Yes. Um, yeah, it's quite a change, isn't it? Nowadays, they, they toss material in a second. Uh, and apparently, it only takes them, I mean, we've been playing this game for 600 years, and apparently, it, all it takes is four hours. So. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> Let's talk about Alpha Zero's accomplishment. Yeah. What do you see uh, the meaning behind Alpha Zero being able to beat Stockfish after only looking at the game for four hours with no other uh, human intervention whatsoever? Well, obviously, this four hour thing is not too relevant, though it's a nice punchline, but uh, it's obviously a very powerful hardware. So this is equivalent to my laptop sitting for a couple of decades. Um, I think the more relevant thing is that it uh, figured everything out from scratch. And that is, well, scary and uh, promising if you look at it. Um, Why do you say that? Why do you say scary and promising? Um, because I would like to think that um, that it should be a little bit harder. Uh, it, it feels annoying that uh, uh, you can work things out from just the rules of chess in, in that quickly. Uh, and the implication for other areas, uh, uh, I don't know. To be honest, I, I also don't have a lot of the details there. I'd like to know more about uh, the, the conditions under which stock played and uh, what exactly happened. But um, if suddenly, what is very impressive is this, uh, that it sees so few positions. Alpha Zero is seeing 80,000 positions per second. So far, somehow this is back to the human approach because right. the brute force approach, I mean, they were crushing us with brute force as well, but um, if some sort of mixture of um, or training a computer to uh, do it in a human-like thought process, um, that is fascinating. I, but like I said, I'd like to see more info now. I'd like them to explain this a bit better. Uh, I read the paper and it was incomprehensible to me. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, I went through the same challenge as well. Twenty years on since the computer, now um, more than twenty years, computer has defeated Kaspar, the Deep Blue defeated Kasparov. We're used to engines beating us uh, at chess. Is that an issue for us now that Alpha Zero was able to to do this? It, all it did was beat Stockfish, which Stockfish was already beating all the best players. No, no, there is no ego hassle for us anymore. Uh, we are. That train has left the station. We, um, I don't, I don't think any uh, human being even fancies that he has a chance. I mean, if we play 100 games against Stockfish, we'll be happy to draw one. So um, uh, that is pretty much hopeless. And the fact that uh, we are losing with extra material as well, that for me is even more annoying because I would think if you give me a pawn, I should be able to, you know, I should be able to hold on. But that even that uh, with two pawns and all, that you're not able to uh, beat them. Um, but this is very interesting because it, suddenly um, it opens the door to some, maybe even I'm posing the computer some intelligent questions instead of always having to look at its conclusions and then try to figure out all the answers yourself. Uh, imagine, um, not a conversation, but some sort of intelligent uh, querying uh, could reveal very interesting things about chess. It's just very early to say, but uh, fascinating news. What are the implications for top-level chess, the possibility that one of your colleagues might get a hold of this technology before you do? Uh, were you worried about anything like that? I haven't gotten that far yet. Um, uh, well, it's Didn't mean to scare you. No, 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 I haven't gotten that far yet. And, uh, I, no, I simply hadn't thought of that aspect. That's, uh, surprisingly, that's one aspect that never even occurred to me. Um, but it's interesting. It might reveal a whole lot of new things about chess, especially these few games they released, this Queen's Indian defense. It's fascinating. Um, well, I'll have to tell you the moves. The, the one where it goes Queen g4, Knight h6, checking g7, and b c3, and black is completely underdeveloped. And then black wins the h6 knight. And all white has is pure uh, peace play. So the two rooks, the two bishops, and the queen. And black is underdeveloped, but a whole piece up and... Uh, and what's fascinating for me is that Stockfish keeps on saying it's equal. So it, it thinks that white has to repeat. And I don't know, I'm not able to uh, understand what alpha is, alpha zero is seeing. Um, because it, it could be seeing that it's a win already, or it simply could be playing on because it thinks it's worth playing on. I mean, it's almost a human way of uh, approaching it. Um, like I said, for the moment, there are far more questions than answers. But, uh, it's, it's the first exciting thing that's happened in um, computer, uh, computers playing chess in a long time. Because as you pointed out, I mean, since 97, uh, they can beat us faster. They
smaller number. That's, that's not that interesting. This suggests that there are still uh, things to be learned about this. Indeed. Well, thanks very much for sharing all your insights with us, and good luck with the rest of your games. Sure. Thank you. Thank you.